In this presentation, I'm going to show you how to install OpenLink's single tier Express Edition drivers for MySQL databases. I'll be working on a Mac OS X client operating system. Before I begin the install, I do want to point out that it's a good idea to have your evaluation or permanent license key somewhere on your Mac system. This will enable you to use our installer's browse feature to pick up and implement the license during the install process. This renders your driver ready for use as soon as the install completes. If you choose to obtain a license post-installation, use of the product will be delayed until that license is in place. That said, let's begin the install procedure. Double-click the disk image file that contains your product installer. Here you see my disk image file is named MVL6EMY. 5.dmg. Your installer should have an identical or very similar name. This DMG will produce a meta package or .mpkg file. Double click that. A splash screen should come up. Click the continue button. This is the readme. We recommend that you do read it over. Click continue. This is the license agreement. We recommend that you read it over as well. Provided that you agree with the terms of this license agreement, click continue and the agree button that follows shortly thereafter. Choose the destination volume for your driver. Click continue. This change install location button allows you to override the default installation directory and install to a new location. We recommend that you go with the default if you are new to the product. So click install. Installation does require administrative privileges on the box, so do provide your administrative username and password. Click OK. Give the product some time to actually install. The product is installed, so we can close out of this dialog. However, we still need to license the product. A supplementary license dialog should appear somewhere on your desktop. It has been known to pop under other elements on desktops, so you may need to close out a few things. Here it is. This is the license dialog. This dialog presents you with three options. You can use the later button to forgo product licensing until a later date. If you do not currently have an evaluation or a permanent license key, but you do want to license the product now, click this try or buy button over here. This will launch the OpenLink website in a browser. There you'll be able to obtain the license that you need. If you already have a license, just click use existing license and browse your Mac OS X system for it. Note, if you're not sure whether or not you have the correct license file, the license dialog always provides the name of the license that it's looking for. This installer is looking for ee underscore my5 underscore lt dot lic. Note that I have this license file over here on the left. So I'm just going to click the use existing license button and now I'm just going to browse for that license. You can see that it's on my desktop. There it is. I'm clicking choose. This product is now installed, licensed, and ready for use. This concludes this lesson.